There are a lot of really incredible hearing aids available for 2024, and today you'll learn about the five best hearing aids that could help you. As an audiologist, seeing new technology that helps people hear their family, as well as going out to restaurants and parties with lots of background noise, and actually being able to understand people's speech, it just fills me with joy. So if you're looking to get hearing aids for the first time or upgrade, stick around. We have a lot of great options coming up. We're judging the hearing aids based off of overall sound quality and the ability to match the hearing aid to your individual hearing loss. So let's get right into it with number five, Signia Pure Charge and Go. When people try this hearing aid, one of the first things they notice is how it processes their own voice. Hearing your own voice amplified through your hearing aid, especially for the first time, can be jarring. It can be really unpleasant. But the Signia Pure Charge and Go automatically detects and reduces these unwanted sounds. It uses a dual processing system that better separates out speech from background noise. Even when moving around and when talking to my patients, it holds up. This hearing aid is on the gentler side of amplification, so may not be appropriate for all kinds of hearing loss. One thing we don't like about this hearing aid is there's no feature to find a lost hearing aid like some of the other options on this list. And some other cons, people complain that the thin wires don't hug the ear very well and are a little noticeable. I've also seen complaints about their lost hearing aid policy, so look into those terms if you're considering purchasing the Signia devices. Number four, Starkey Genesis AI. There's been a lot of great advances in sound quality due to artificial intelligence, or AI, and Starkey Genesis is a great example. It uses AI to make over 80,000 adjustments to the sound per hour. This hearing aid is uniquely good for people who like to listen to music or are musicians themselves. For people who have upgraded to this Starkey model, they tend to love it. A theme in conversations with my patients is that their voices are clearer when compared to some competitors. Starkey has also recently improved the wire shape of how it fits in your ear, which really wasn't so great in older models. Another great bonus feature is the Starkey's fall detection. So if you or whoever's wearing this device loses their balance while wearing the hearing aids, you can set your hearing aids to automatically contact someone through Bluetooth and notification. Some downsides we've heard of the Starkey is that the app is hard to learn, and again, that receiver wire still just doesn't sit great in the ear. It's a little noticeable. We have the three best hearing aids for 2024 coming up, but take a moment right now and find the button below to subscribe to the Treble Health channel, where we focus on better hearing and tinnitus relief. It would mean a lot to me. Number three, Phonak Audeo Lumity. Phonak is one of the most popular brands out there. This model is particularly good for someone with a more severe hearing loss. At those higher levels of loss, Hearing aids need to increase the volume of sound a lot more, which can cause really unpleasant whistling or feedback in the device. This Phonak, however, does a great job of managing feedback compared to other competitors, which is great because no one likes a hearing aid that whistles. What really helps sound quality for these hearing aids is the AutoSense technology, which will pick up what kind of sound environment you're in and change its settings accordingly without you having to press any buttons. Your audiologist can also program specific settings for streaming, so if you get a phone call or are listening to music, it can automatically switch to a pre-programmed setting. People have complained about the hands-free Bluetooth, however, calling it annoying. Number two on our best hearing aids of 2024 list is the Widex Moment Shear. Widex doesn't release new models as often as its competitors, but they make up for it in hearing aids that can outperform the competition for long stretches of time. My patients who use these Widex hearing aids love them, and one thing I'll hear them often say is that these sound way more natural compared to the other options I've tried. So that natural sound quality being probably one of the most valuable pieces of judging a hearing aid. I believe that Widex hearing aids are best for moderate hearing losses, so if you have a very mild or a very severe hearing loss, I wouldn't recommend Widex. You might be better off with some other options on this list. That's because the feedback management isn't the best and Widex tends to have a stronger sound compared to some other products on this list. Some cons for the Widex, the charger isn't great, it's not very portable and isn't very travel friendly. I will also say people either love or hate this hearing aid. Most people love them who try them, of course. For people with lower levels of hearing loss, the Widex can feel too powerful and overwhelming. So if you're looking for your first hearing aid and you just have a mild loss, it might be a tough transition for you. Our number one best hearing aid for 2024 is the Oticon Real. 
The Otacon Reel is a major improvement when compared to previous Otacon models, and Otacon generally is a manufacturer known for excellent sound quality. This particular device addresses a number of complaints that people generally have about hearing aids. The hearing aids do an excellent job in noisy places like a restaurant, a social event, having friends over for dinner, family events, and the feedback management so that no one hears whistling when they don't need to and that they can still hear as best as possible even if their hearing loss is a little tricky is really spot on. The Oticon Reel has one specific feature I'd like to highlight that when people use it, they absolutely love it. So generally speaking, when you have hearing aid up and behind the ear, it's called the receiver in the canal style and the microphone where sound enters the hearing aid is just behind the ear. So it's right next to our hair. And if we scratch our head, or if we move our head in certain ways or put on glasses, you'll often hear the sound of our hair scratching against the microphone. And because it's so close to the microphone, it can sound really loud. But with the Oticon devices, they've figured out a way to keep the hearing aids excellent sound quality, allow you to keep hearing very well, but reduce that very hypersensitive noise. So generally speaking, people do enjoy this. Oticon Real tends to be best for people with significant high-pitched hearing loss. Now, most folks do have a high-pitched hearing loss, but sometimes the slope or the intensity of the loss in those high pitches can vary. But even those who have a significant steep drop in the high pitches, the Oticon devices will do very well. And that's because of their excellent new feedback system, which really reduces the whistling noise almost to nothing. And that's a significant improvement compared to the last generation of Oticon hearing aids. The sound quality of the devices, like every hearing aid on this list, is great. And it's one of the most popular hearing aids for a reason. It's really good at helping people hear clearly, even when there's a lot of background noise. There's not too many cons for the Oticon Real Hearing Aid, although speaking to some colleagues as I was preparing this list, the receiver wire could be a bit better in terms of how it's designed. Picking the right hearing aid is an important decision, but just because a hearing aid is ranked highly on this list doesn't mean it's the right hearing aid for you. There are numerous factors to consider, particularly what are the situations that you're having the most trouble in, how tech savvy are you or do you want to be, and what kind of hearing loss do you have that is discovered through the hearing test. Based on that information, an excellent audiologist that you work with can recommend the technology that's most likely to work. And then the audiologist can program that device and customize it over time as you learn and adapt to the new hearing aid. So find that button below right now and subscribe to the Treble Health YouTube channel for more great videos on better hearing and tinnitus relief. I'm very excited to know how this goes for you because I want you back in those conversations, hearing people clearly, not having to ask for repetitions. And when that happens, I wanna see you back here on our channel. Take care.